Hi guys, it's so good to be with you again. This is my granddaughter Zuri. You will remember her. Hi. And Zuri, what are we going to be exploring today? Fraction. Okay, great. So we're going to be making a fraction robot. Let's see. Hmm, what will we need? Pencil. Great, and I also have scissors, a straight edge for drawing lines, and two bottle tops for tracing circles. A big one and a smaller one. Those are our tools. And the papers we will need are first a big sheet of plain paper for the background, a small circle which I traced with this shape. A bigger circle that I traced with that shape. Then I used my handy dandy ruler and I drew some straight lines. So I have one long strip, a good size square. It's not as big as that circle, but bigger than that one. I have a tiny rectangle and a little heart. I have two small squares and two small rectangles. And that's about all we'll need for this craft. So Zuri, if I want to divide this circle in half, how many pieces am I going to have? Two. That's correct. Could you fold this one in half for me, please? Exactly in half. Thank you. And suppose I want to divide this one into quarters. How many pieces will I need? Four. That's correct. So fold it for me twice. Fold it. That's two pieces there. And fold it again. It's a little stiff and we have to make sure that the pieces are exactly the same. Because in when we have quarters, all pieces are equal. equal. That's correct. So now what we're going to do, open them back up. And we're going to cut on the line. Can you cut this right on the crease line for me, please? Go. Here, just this is. Remember, cut it exactly on right on that crease line. Right on the line. Let's let's get started. That's it. Go ahead. Let me hold it steady. Cut. That's it. Two equal pieces. Now we're going to cut this into quarters. Open wide, open the scissors nice and wide. That's it. And put it together. Make another quart cut. That will be our quarter. That's it. Four equal pieces. No. One more thing I want to cut for now, and that's this. I think we will cut this in half. How many equal pieces will we have? Two. That's correct. Let's cut it. Oh, very good cutting. Excellent. Now we're going to put these halves together at the top. How do we use the glue again? That's correct. You remember. Alright. Now go ahead and glue up the other piece while I set this down. You put glue on the other yellow half. Okay, that's not a Oh, that's a I lot of glue. To do okay, so let's paste this half right beside the other half. Right up beside it. That's it. Good. Two halves. And how many quarters? One. How many? Okay, Zuri, can you fold that into quarters for me? Okay. 
blindfold and then now the fold. Remember, get it really even. All right, can you just snip them into four pieces? One snip here. Good job. And another snip here. Yes, and one more snip. Good, so we have four equal pieces. So let's put a little glue on each piece. Just a dab on each. So yes, you place another arm there. And you can place two down there for the robot legs. We're making a fraction robot. Ever heard of a fraction robot before? No. Okay, well this will be a first for you. He can be doing anything he, you want him to do with those legs. Okay, now these halves are going to be his robot feet. There we go. One over here. This way, turn this way. Yes. And one on the other foot. We have so we're going to cut the heart shape in half. You want to do this, Nick? Mm -hmm. I'll hold it. You squeeze. Oh, there we go. And these are going to be the eyes. and put that one in place. I'm folding this little strip into three Zuri. One, good, thank you. Two, three. So each one is what fraction? Do you know? These are halves, these are quarters, and these are? Where? What fraction though? Third. Three equal pieces are called? Third. That's right. Third. One, two, three. Well, Mr. Robot doesn't have a nose. He can't smell anything. But he does have hands. Shall we cut this into four? And when we cut it into four, what does that mean? Does it make third? Or does it make half? What does it make when it's cut into four? Quarters. 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 So we are going to put all four quarters over here. One. That's right. Two. Three and four. Four quarters right there and four quarters on this side. Alright, now the last thing we are going to add. I am going to cut this into thirds. How many pieces is that going to be? Three? If I'm cutting into thirds, how many pieces would that be? Thirds. Can you tell me? Three. That's it. Three equal pieces. And I'm going to do the same here. Again. Three equal pieces are called thirds. Yes. And these are going to be? The fingers. Ah, you get these. Let's put them in. It's going to be tricky. I think we're going to put these fingers. One. Are you finished with those fingers? Two. And three. Third. So, let's just think about it again. Quarters give how many equal pieces? Four. Halves give how many equal pieces? 
two. And third, give how many equal pieces? Three. Absolutely. And so, so now our fraction robot is ready to go. Go, go, go. Beep. And a robot. Bye.